All right, let's take a look at uh, crude oil. All right, so let's break this down into a quick video. Uh, there's a couple setups we look for um, inside of this, what, what I call a running ATR. All right, so the new indicator that I have coming out to all the members, and um, we do not need to run the strategy by itself now. You can run the indicator by itself or the strategy. Yeah, this is the ES. I'll go to crude in a second. I'm sorry. This is the S&P. But what we want to do is these yellow dots right here, that's what I call a running ATR. And once the dots start printing, then what we want to do is we want to look for speed in the market to look for retracements or what's called a WPT, catching the wrongly positioned traders. So there's two setups. First, we wait for the first dot to print. Once it starts printing, I like to see higher lows on the symmetry dots. Here's a higher low. Here's a higher low just to see if we got a nice little running ATR. It's not necessary. But if you look, when the first dot prints, we want to try to buy the pullback. We want to try to buy here. We want to try to buy this pullback where the triangle fires. The ultimate stop would be a close, a whole body close outside of the ATR. As long as the ATR stays intact, it will keep running and we look for more retracements. This is a buy, this is a buy. Now what I've done with the indicator is I got it in the strategy you're gonna be getting is I have additional setups you can run. So if you look right here, it's called add trades. So I can add trades, add more additional trades. So you can see there's, once I hit add trades, then I can get additional setups. You'll see more triangles fire and it added another trade in there. Okay, so the whole purpose of adding trades was to get more setups inside of a running ATR. Once the ATR prints, that's when we start looking for setups. We're gonna look for a retracement trade here, or what's called a WPT. Now the strategy I've run in today, I have a WTPT running and a retracement strategy running. So this is a WPT. This is what I show in the room. This is a 23 ATR and this is a 20 ATR. Or this may even be a 15 ATR, but um, this is what's called a WPT. A WPT is when you have an opposite color. You have an opposite color speed box that comes into the ATR. These are your are going to be some of your highest reward to risk trades you're going to get because these fire pretty much right exactly on the ATR. So I'll show you some examples going forward on this uh, WPT. But if you see an opposite color candle that comes in with the overall trend of the ATR, those are some of your best setups because look at your entry is right. Traders can even put limit orders at the ATR. Any close outside of it would be a stop out. But if you see an opposite color candle inside of the running ATR, that is a, what's called a wrongly positioned traders. These are retracement trades. These are all retracement trades. I love when they come right down to the ATR, right on them. It creates a really nice opportunity on retracement trading, okay? So there's two ways we can do it. We can do retracement trades with the triangles, or, or we can do what's called a WPT, which is wrongly positioned traders. Now the WPT, which I'll show you, is here. So, so here you have a running ATR, there's a retracement triangle, retracement triangle. Look at your WPT, how low risk this is. Very low risk, high, high reward. You're right on symmetry.confluence. You got an opposite color. You have an opposite color speed bar that came in that closed. That's telling you it's catching the rolling position traders. You'll wait, you put a limit order in right there, stop below, or wait for a positive market delta, which is a green Rinko bar, and you're good to go. Another WPT, I'll show you what it looks like. Here it is again, catching the low, two WPTs. You have your indicator starting to show the dots. That means we're gonna start looking for setups. Remember, we don't look to buy this first triangle. This first triangle tells us these dots start printing after this first triangle forms. 
So once this first dot forms and starts running, then we look for WPTs, which are wrongly positioned traders getting caught. It's a volume spike into support, a volume spike into resistance. And the WPTs caught the two lows right there. And the retracement trades caught these moves. You notice the retracement trades, the best ones are going to be right on top of your ATR. But I really like the WPT trades because they're right on top of support or resistance. If you look at any market, let's see if I find another one here for you. They don't come up very often. When they come up here, here we go again. You can tell the, the ATR dots start printing at 8 o'clock in the morning. We start running. We get a retracement trade here, retracement trade there. Works out great. But look how the WPTs catch the rolling position traders right at the low of that move. This is a big move. This is 45.14 all the way to 34. You're talking about 15, 16, 17 S&P points with a very small stop just below a close below this. Now, I had the symmetry dots at 25. Uh, if you want to, if you want to match right over top the ATR, you can put 23. I put in 25 just so you can see confluence. But the WPT is is that's one of my favorite trades now because you're catching these wrongly positioned traders with this volume spike into support or resistance. So you got a lot of sellers coming into support. That's why that box forms the red box. Everything is based upon order flow in these markets. It's not our opinions. Our opinions are worthless. Don't listen to me. Don't listen to Gerald. Don't listen to yourself. You really got to see what the market's doing internally. These speed bars tell us what's going, going on internally. Because see, when you see this red trend box come up, it tells you that support. They're trying to catch the rolling position traders. When you see these green trend boxes print inside the running ATR, that means volume spike coming up. Look for the first retracement. That's a nice retracement buy. There's your stop. Another retracement buy. There's your stop. Retracement buy. Very many retracement. There's your stop. Retracement. Retracement. But I really like these WPTs because they're right on support. Now, crude have caught that big move on crude yesterday too. Is that if you notice, we got a WT this morning. This is two days in a row. It's caught a crude oil in the morning. Yesterday it caught that big move in the morning. Now it's one for one again this morning on crude oil. Right there's my WPT. It never closed below my symmetry dots and never closed below my ATR. It's a lot of break it intra bar but not close below it. So that's a nice little crude trade this morning at 15 to 45. That was 30 ticks. If we look yesterday's was a real nice one in the morning just before 8 o'clock. We had a WPT catch it right at the low. Look at this WPT. I mean, you can't get better than this, guys. This new indicator with the ATR and the WPT trades and retracement trades really give you a lot of opportunity. So if I skinny that down, right there's your WPT at 7.50 in the morning. We say, listen, look at these markets at 7.45 to 10.30. Look at that WPT. That is a 68.90 buy. Got as high as 70.20 just on the first push. That's a 150 tick move with a small stop. 150 tick move. Beautiful trade on crude oil. Look how it stayed inside the ATR also. There's a retracement trade, retracement, retracement, retracement. I love retracement trades like this in hot markets. Right on support, it fires. Here's another one. You can take this WPT. It never closed below the symmetry dots, so I would take that. Let me blow that up. Look how we closed below the ATR. That's why it stopped printing. However, it never closed below my symmetry dots. I would take a stab at that. As long as we stay above the ATR and symmetry dots, if you're manually trading this, that is another buy signal for a WPT, catching the wrongly position traders. And then we were good to go. So that's what type of moves we can get if we just pay attention to these WPT trades and these retracement trades. All right, so that's what we tried to do this morning. Same thing, caught crude oil. I mean, uh, it caught the S&P. This is my WPT trade this morning also. All right.